Dear students, in this topic we shall discuss the role of ion channels in self excitation. The basis of self excitation of pacemakers is the inherent leakiness of sinoatrial nodal fibers to sodium and calcium ions. This leakiness is due to the presence of three types of ion channels in their membranes. These are the fast sodium channels, slow sodium calcium channels and potassium channels. These channels activate and deactivate at a pace that keeps the resting membrane potential much less negative that is only minus 55 millivolt as compared to minus 85 to minus 90 millivolt in other cells. It also keeps an unstable and rising resting membrane potential due to continuous influx of sodium and calcium ions. Dear students, the fast sodium channels open immediately as the membrane potential goes less negative than minus 55 millivolt after an action potential when hyperpolarization occurs. They remain open for only few milliseconds because as they open, they let the sodium ions to immediately move inside the cell. This sodium ion influx prevents developing a stable and more negative resting membrane potential. These channels become inactivated uh, and blocked above minus 55 millivolts. Dear students, minus 55 millivolt and above K level per slow sodium calcium channels open hona shuru ho jate hain. Ye channels comparatively slowly open hote hain aur is liye sodium ions in ke through ahista ahista andar ki taraf leak hona shuru ho jate hain. As a result, membrane potential gradually rises. This rise prevents to establish a stable resting membrane potential. Is there a say minus 55 millivolt per B resting membrane potential stable nahi hota, balke aista aista rise karta chala jata hai. Rise karte huye ye membrane potential jab minus 40 millivolts per pohita hai, to this is the threshold level at which the sodium calcium channels become activated maximally. So, the influx of sodium and calcium ions starts rapidly. That triggers, that triggers an action potential. Dear students, the rise in membrane potential is slower in the range of minus 55 to minus 40 millivolts. So, the sinoatrial nodal action potential is slower to develop. Ye jo sinoatrial nodal fibers ka action potential hai, ye is vaja se slowly develop hota hai as compared to the action potentials of ventricular muscle fibers. Dear students, now we shall discuss the role of potassium channels. After the action potential, the potassium channels open slowly. Their opening causes the return of membrane potential back to its negative uh, state. However, owing to their slow activation, duration of sinoatrial nodal action potential is longer. <laughs> 